Embryology is important in understanding how the lymphatic system develops. We will explore the intricate process of lymphatic development, which is vital for our circulatory and immune systems. Join us to learn more about this fascinating topic. Lymphatic vessels have specific endothelial cells that differ from blood vessels. Transcription factors like ProX1 and SOX18 promote the commitment of venous cells to a lymphatic fate. VEG for 3 signaling and crosstalk between pathways also play important roles. Lymphatic vessel sprouting, a crucial process in development, involves the growth and branching of vessels. VEGFC and VEGFD stimulate sprouting, while CXCR4 and CXCL12 attract cells. Semaphorins and neuropylins guide cells and direct vessel growth towards target areas. Vascular endothelial growth factors, VEGFs, have emerged as key regulators of lymphangiogenesis. VEGFC and VEGFD, secreted by various cell types including macrophages and fibroblasts, bind to VEG for 3 on lymphatic endothelial cells, promoting their proliferation, survival and migration. Importantly, VEGFC and VEGFD induce lymphatic vessel remodeling and enlargement. Additionally, VEGFA, primarily known for its role in angiogenesis, also contributes to lymphatic vessel growth and function. The intricate interplay between different VEGFs and their receptors orchestrates the dynamic process of lymphangiogenesis. The formation and function of lymphatic valves are essential for maintaining proper lymphatic flow. During development, specific endothelial cells called valve precursors undergo complex changes and acquire a valve-forming phenotype due to the activation of signaling pathways. The formation of intercellular junctions and extracellular matrix components also play a role in the morphogenesis and functioning of lymphatic valves. Any disruption in valve development can lead to lymphatic disorders and impaired lymphatic function. Lymphatic vessels are important for immune cell movement and antigen transport. Dendritic cells capture antigens and migrate to lymph nodes through lymphatic vessels. Lymphatic endothelial cells help immune cell entry and also contribute to immune tolerance. Overall, the lymphatic system and immune system work together to maintain immune balance. Lymphatic development is governed by a complex interplay between genetic and environmental factors. Genetic mutations in key regulators of lymphatic development, such as ProX1 and FOX2, can lead to lymphatic malformations and diseases. Additionally, environmental factors such as hypoxia, inflammation, and mechanical forces play crucial roles in shaping lymphatic vessel development. Understanding the influence of genetics and the environment on lymphatic development is essential for the diagnosis and management of lymphatic disorders. After the initial establishment of lymphatic vessels, subsequent maturation and remodeling processes occur to ensure their functionality. The maturation process involves the recruitment of mural cells, including smooth muscle cells and parasites, to lymphatic vessels. These mural cells play a crucial role in vessel stability and lymphatic pumping. The remodeling of lymphatic vessels occurs in response to tissue growth, injury, or physiological changes. In situations such as wound healing or tumors, lymphatic vessels can undergo enlargement and sprouting to meet the increased demand for fluid drainage. The development of the lymphatic system involves different cell populations with distinct origins. Dermal lymphatic vessels come from the mesenchyme, while visceral lymphatic vessels arise from venous endothelial cells. Molecular cascades and signaling pathways, such as VEG for 3 notch and SOX18 CUD FIE, control the specification of lymphatic progenitors at different embryonic stages. Lymphatic vessels are important for maintaining fluid balance. They absorb fluid and transport it back to the circulation. They have unique structures that allow for fluid uptake and also use muscle contractions to move fluid towards lymph nodes and the bloodstream. Understanding how lymphatic vessels work is important for understanding fluid balance and immune cell movement. The development of the lymphatic system is essential for maintaining fluid balance, immune responses, and the growth of organs and tissues. Lymphatic vessels guide the formation of organs during development and participate in tissue repair and healing by clearing waste and transporting immune cells and growth factors. Understanding lymphatic embryology is crucial for comprehending overall developmental biology. Lymphatic malformations and diseases encompass a wide range of pathologies that result from disrupted lymphatic development or function. Various genetic and environmental factors contribute to these conditions. Mutations in key genes involved in lymphatic development, such as FLT4 and CCBE1, can lead to conditions like lymphedema and lymphatic dysplasia. Additionally, acquired lymphatic disorders can arise due to infection, trauma, or surgical interventions. Elucidating the molecular mechanisms underlying lymphatic malformations and diseases is crucial for improved diagnostics, management, and the development of targeted therapies. The insights gained from studying lymphatic development have significant clinical implications. Lymphatic disorders, such as lymphedema and lymphatic malformations, pose challenges to healthcare professionals. 
understanding the molecular basis of these conditions enables better diagnosis, counseling, and management approaches. Therapeutic strategies, including surgical interventions, compression therapy, and pharmacological interventions such as VEGFC supplementation, aim to improve lymphatic function and alleviate symptoms. Ongoing research in lymphatic development offers hope for more targeted and effective therapies in the future. The lymphatic system undergoes complex processes during embryonic development. Understanding these processes helps us diagnose and treat lymphatic disorders. This knowledge is essential for medical students to contribute to research and improve patient care.